Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Suku Daily Update. We are going to see the next price targets. And of course, before we continue, do not forget to join our monthly subscription. Links in the description box and in the comment section. Now is the time to join. You can either join Patreon, buy me a coffee or our site and you will get amazing profits because on February, crypto is going to have an amazing run. So do not miss out this opportunity. You can see the benefits in the description box in the links. Okay. And you will get exclusive benefits, including an automated system with 200 altcoins and many, many other. Join us and you won't regret it. Thank you so much for watching. Have a fantastic day wherever you are. Let's go with Suku. Right now, it pumped up like crazy over plus 40% and we had a selling pressure afterwards. This looks on the 4 hour frame like a soothing star. Usually these patterns are bearish. Okay, but we are going to see the next price targets, the support levels and what you should focus on. So right now, what we are going to do first is we are going to draw the, the Fibonacci retracement actually from this bottom that we started our run up to the top onto this hour onto 1st February today. And what we are seeing right now is that we dropped all the way down. Maybe we are going to the 0.618 and we could go even to the 0.38. We have a very high risk with the RSI, a very high risk with the Komodo Channel Index getting into the 522. Usually, the more upwards we go, the more overbought situation we have, the craziest will be the dump afterwards. But anyway, we are going to see next price targets as well. And we have the Stochastic RSI into an overbought. So in the 4-hour frame, that means every candlestick contains for hours of price action, we have a huge risk and therefore you should be careful. Okay, so what do we have right now is that we might be getting into the 0 0.43, 0 0.38 as well. These usually are pump and dump coins. If we get back to the daily frame as well, you can see the same happened on 21st January where we had a crazy spike and then we went down all the way even below the lows of 0 0.36. Of course, you can see that many, many actually uh, traders lost their money there, sold stop losses after stop losses afterwards. And you can see how you can get trapped into a very quick pump. Of course, the pump might continue and we might have an uptrend as well, but you have to be extremely careful because I will tell you why. On the daily frame, we could potentially go even higher. Seeing the daily frame, yes, we have more room to grow. And we have the Commod Channel Index, in which in those quick pumps and dumps, this is what we are looking first. The Commodity Channel Index, in which you can find on the indicators on TradingView, type CCI or Commodity Channel Index, and you will get it. So right now, if we have this line above in an overbought above the 100, then yes, we have a very high risk. Let's see some targets in case we go even, even higher. Where can we possibly go and which target do we need to surpass in order to get to the next price target? So the support levels are the most likely scenario to happen and the correction is more likely to happen right now. But we have a chance of going upwards, despite the fact the high risk that we have in the four hour frame to get back higher. So what we are going to do is we are going to see the 0 0.53 to 54. This is the major resistance level we have to close above in order to get to the 0 0.66 and maybe the 0 0.70. Can we get there? Yes, we can. But I think that in just one day, we will see the price action and in the next day, we are correcting. If we do not correct today, we are going to cor correct tomorrow. This is what usually happens in these quick pump and dump coins. For Suku, only we close below above, sorry, the 0 0.53 to 54, we could get to the next price targets. Of course, this is not financial advice. It's my personal humble opinion. What we can do right here is that after we close at the 0 0.53 and above, yes, we could manage to get another 25% or 30%. However, the risk is very high for Suku and you should be extremely, extremely careful. Okay, but I give you the targets in order to minimize the risk. 
So if you want to enter, you know the closing above conditions. And what do we mean by closing above? We mean that the closing price of the candlestick, not the upper saddle, but the closing price should be above this level right here. If we get that, then yes, we can move towards the next targets. If we do not, then prepare yourself for the 0 0.38, in which there we might be having a buying pressure. Okay. And of course, prepare for lower support levels. At the meantime, we had a higher low pattern right here. The sellers were a little bit tired because you can see that when we get a higher low to the price and the stochastic RSI is in an oversold situation two times with the same bottom, but we have a higher low to the price, this is a bullish indicator that tells us that probably the price is going to go higher because the sellers are being tired and are getting exhausted actually, and buyers will soon step into the market. So right now, that's why I'm sad. That's why we had this pump. Of course, you cannot predict these crazy pumps, all right. But you can have some directions in which an altcoin could pump up and could soon get further upwards. Money transferred there. You can see many people got sell pressure right there. Many people sold around here. And of course, this is the price level that you should be looking at. And not only that, but the 0 0.66 to 67 and the 0 0.70 after we get even even higher, if we get even even higher due to the high risk that we have on the four hour frame mainly, but on the daily frame, we could possibly be having, be getting into an overbought situation soon without a further price pump. Okay. Of course, you should be careful and check the price targets before you actually enter the market. Of course, you should always do your own research and this is for educational purposes. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription. It is the time right now to do your chance and do yourself a favor to enter us and join our beautiful team that we have built in the crypto. Thank you. See you soon with many, many more videos. Bye.